Hey guys, it's the test lead. And today I'm going over possible interview questions related to software testing methodologies and frameworks. I will be covering questions on the waterfall methodology, agile methodology, scrum framework, Kanban methodology, and general QA methodology. Waterfall methodology. What is the waterfall methodology and how does it work? The waterfall methodology is a linear and sequential approach to software development. It consists of distinct phases such as requirements, design, implementation, testing, deployment, and maintenance. With each phase building upon the previous one. It's important to note that you can't start the next phase without completely finishing the previous phase. What are some of the advantages of using the waterfall model? Waterfall provides a structured and well-documented process. It is easy to understand and manage, making it suitable for small projects with clear requirements. What are some disadvantages to the waterfall model? The main drawbacks include inflexibility to changes, lengthy development cycles, and the risk of delivering a product that does not meet user needs due to limited early user feedback. Agile methodology. Explain the Agile methodology and its principles. Agile is an iterative and flexible approach to software development that prioritizes customer collaboration, responding to change, and delivering working software in short iterations. Principles include customer satisfaction, embracing changes, and frequent delivery of valuable software. What is a user story in Agile, and how is it used? A user story is a brief and formal description of a software feature from an end user or customer perspective. It helps to capture functional requirements and serves as a basis for development and testing tasks. What is a sprint in Agile development? A sprint is a time box iteration in Agile, typically lasting two to four weeks. It includes planning, development, testing, and review, aiming to deliver a potentially shippable product increment at the end. Scrum Framework Explain the Scrum Framework and its roles. Scrum is an agile framework that divides the development process into fixed length iterations called sprints. Key roles include the product owner, Scrum master, and development team. What is a product backlog in Scrum? The product backlog is a prioritized list of features, enhancements, and fixes that the development team works on during sprints. It is maintained and prioritized by the product owner. What is the purpose of a daily standup in Scrum? The daily standup or daily scrum is a brief meeting where team members share updates on their progress, discuss challenges, and plan their work for the day. It promotes communication and collaboration. Quick break. If you're enjoying the video so far, please like, 
share and subscribe if you need help on your software testing journey check out my website thetestinglead.com now back to the video Kanban methodology what is Kanban and how does it differ from Scrum Kanban is a visual management method that focuses on continuous delivery Kanban does not have fixed length iterations and allows for a more fluid workflow. Explain the concept of WIP, which stands for Work in Progress, Limits, and Kanban. WIP limits and Kanban restrict the number of items allowed at each stage of the workflow. It helps to prevent overloading the team and ensures a smooth and efficient process. How does Kanban support continuous improvement? Kanban encourages teams to regularly review and improve their processes. By visualizing the workflow, identifying bottlenecks, teams can make incremental changes to enhance efficiency. General QA methodology. What is the role of QA in agile development? QA and agile involves collaborating with the development team throughout the development process. It includes test planning, automation, and ensuring that quality is maintained in each sprint. How do you prioritize test cases in agile? Test cases in Agile are prioritized based on business value and risk. Critical and high-risk features tested first to ensure that the most important aspects of the application are validated. What is regression testing and why is it important? Regression testing is the practice of retesting a software application after changes to ensure that existing functionalities still work as expected. It is crucial to catch any unintended side effects of code changes. If you got any value from this video, don't forget to leave a like. If you want to see another video just like this, please click here. And most importantly, don't forget this, learn something new today.